Before we dive into today's topic, here's a 20-minute clip exploring why Tzatziki did what she did to Diamond the Body. It sheds light on the drama, behind-the-scenes tensions, and the real reason why things escalated between them. Stay tuned because we're about to break down all the details and the motivations behind Tzatziki's actions. Was it just for the show, or was there something more going on? We'll find out in this clip. Call it. Oh yeah, Diamond had brought up um, her nephew, Krishan baby or whatever. Yeah, blah, 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 blah. That ain't even what, what's really supposed to be talked about. Now, like I said, y'all know that shit ain't really phasing Tseki. Like, they done, come on, dog, it ain't phasing her. But y'all know what's really phasing her, though? That she got. Yeah, y'all ain't really heard her talk about her before. Because now that's one she do not play about. But now that's what I'm finna get y'all the inside scoop on. Shit that they not telling y'all for real. Now, Diamond don't notice herself, though. Diamond don't notice herself. But so I guess basically, um... It was Tseki like birthday or some shit like that. And she was just trying to do some other shit. Like, I don't know. I guess to please her man. And y'all know what people usually do when they trying to please their man when they come to shit like that. Birthdays, parties, and shit like that. So I guess Tseki offered him if he wanted to do a love. One, two, three. I ain't gonna say it on her because I don't know if TikTok be banning and shit like that when you say them words. But yeah, she basically asked him if he wanted to have a one, two, three. And he was with it but this where she wasn't with it which y'all probably done already added one plus one she asked him like yo who you want to do it with like who we you know who we you know and this is before all the whole baddie shit, for real like she was on the show but diamond wasn't on the show the said diamond i guess he already been feeling her out shit, like the second this really dive into it Welcome to my channel, it's Erica Trinnell, and today we're diving into some behind-the-scenes drama on baddies involving Tzatziki, Chrissy and Rock's sister, and how she's using the baby for sympathy from the viewers. Let's get real. Tzatziki has been riding the wave of her sister Chrissy and Rock's fame, especially by leveraging Chrissy and son, Chrissy and Porter. She's been out here acting like she's defending her nephew. But in reality, this drama has little to do with the baby and everything to do with Taseki's own issues, particularly her jealousy of Diamond the Body. You can't help but see how Taseki is using her family ties to get attention from the audience while holding deep resentment against Diamond, all because her boyfriend allegedly wanted a threesome with Diamond. It's wild, right? People have been flocking to Taseki's defense, thinking she's protecting her nephew's honor. But the truth is, this was all about her personal beef. She had this animosity way before Diamond even showed up on Baddies. And let's be clear, none of this was ever about the baby or Chrissy and Rock. Jealousy plays a big part in this drama, especially when Taseki has been in her sister's shadow, seeing her rise in popularity. What's crazy is that during the whole season, Tzatziki didn't show any real concern for her sister. When Christine was dealing with her issues, including jail time, Tzatziki was more interested in boasting about her own successes than supporting her. It makes you wonder if Christine wasn't famous, would anyone even know who Tzatziki is? It was obvious something else was going on when Tzatziki barely acknowledged Christine's struggles. Her actions on the reunion episode were all the proof we needed. She didn't bring anything to the table the whole season, only to come out swinging at the reunion for reasons that had nothing to do with her nephew. It was about her personal insecurities and unresolved beef with Diamond. Let's not forget, Diamond didn't even know Taseki had a problem with her. And Taseki got a free paycheck without contributing anything worthwhile, acting like someone's auntie on the sidelines for most of the season. She's got the nerve to try and tear down someone who's been a key player on this platform. And in my opinion, if you're walking behind someone who helped build a platform, you owe them a level of respect. So what's really going on here? Is Taseki just bitter about being in her sister's shadow? Or is this something deeper? Either way, using Chrissy and Son as a pawn to gain sympathy is just low. Thanks for tuning into my channel with Erica Trinnell. Be sure to check out my website at www.ericatrinnell.com for more exclusive updates and insights.